do it. You scrawled on this video to do it. It's your boy, Daddy Scobar Dreamer. Alright y'all, we back with another big body banger, you feel me? Listen, today we got something different. I ain't never reacted to something like this before. This is some fufu, right? This dude sends his kids to school every day, right? And one day, he gets word that the teacher forced his son to put on a dress. Now, y'all know how the world go, right? People is crazy. I don't care how crazy you think he is. If you put my my son and forcing my son inside of a mother effing dress at school, your whole family's going to, into the grave. You know what I'm saying? Because why? First of all, let's think about it, right? Let's really what 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 was the actual reasoning behind this? I'm very curious to watch this video. So I'm not, I'm really not going to talk that much beforehand because I, I really want to watch the video because I want to know exactly what went on. I want to know what the teacher says her reasoning is. As to why she forced my son to put a freaking dress on. You sound stupid. You sound I, I hope she I hope she I hope she goes to jail for, for like some some weird charge or something like that. Like freaking I don't know. I I just hope something go go wrong with these teachers. Cause these teachers, you know what I'm saying? Well, y'all don't know, but I was homeschooled. So I never but I never really went to school. So I don't I don't I don't know what these teachers think they got going on, but it is definitely not. Putting my kid in the dress, that's definitely not what's going on. Because I'll be the first one over there putting you inside a grave. You know what I'm saying? Putting you inside a casket. Because why the heck? And the kid, never mind. I, I want to watch the video. Because I'm making all these assumptions. I'm Honestly, I ain't watched the video, so I don't know what the heck went on. I don't know if it's the dad that came to the, the school. I don't know if the teacher actually made the son put the dress on. I, I don't know if the son wanted to wear the dress. I'm assuming all this stuff. I'm assuming she forced him. But we finna watch this. So if you decide for this video, smash the like button. You know what I'm saying? Before we hop into it, joy.com, you can buy two good third free or bundle up, say $50. And let's go in it. I'm not going to pause it through the whole thing. Yeah. I'm yeah. She called me and told me that she had an issue up here about my grandson being in a dress. I mean, I'm trying to see what the issue is about that. Okay, you're going to have to talk to Gara. Who's Gara? Director. Yeah. Whatever they said she did, she did it. Look at her. She's wearing a flannel and her hair looks stupid. She had this stupid bang on the top of her forehead. She definitely did it. She looks like a man with a wig on. She definitely did it. I could tell. Like I, I don't even know if that's the teacher, but that, that's the part. She did something wrong. I don't, I don't know, but she has done a lot of weird things. I could tell you if that ain't the teacher, she ain't the one that made the silly wooden dress. She did something else that she need to be in jail for. I can tell you right now, just by her fit. Is she the <laughs> Is she the one that was in charge of the kids while my grandson? I, was, but I can't talk to you. What? Why? Because you're you not can't talk to me. Form. What? To, but I can't talk to you. Why? Because you're not on the form. So we'll have to get Dara up here and she, if she will let you. I mean, I don't have to talk to you about it. I mean, first of all, I'm coming down here because we don't do that. The the the, uh, the transgender and all that. You know, we don't do that. I I don't need and to, but he's and I, I, I don't appreciate you encouraging him to put on no dress for the second day too. I don't. The second it. day? This the second time? Take that. And don't think this is going away. I'm going further with this. Okay, you can go down and talk. No, to I'm Sarah. not done talking to you. Ooh, I'm letting you know the next time that you put. And she got the nerve to have the cross up here in the background, man. I ought to slap you with the back of the cross. You sound stupid. She definitely do weird stuff. I'm not. She looks like a weirdo. She looks like she eats batteries. She literally looks ridic ridiculous. You know what I'm saying? Any kid in a dress, we're gonna make you go viral. Okay. You need to go talk to my director because it. Your director not the one that made my kid put a dress on. Why the heck I gotta talk to the director? I haven't talked to you. Why she keep saying I gotta go talk to the what the director gotta do with any of this? She ain't make my kid put a dress on. She ain't the one that's dressed like a freaking pedophile and a weirdo that eat batteries and raisins in a in a potato salad. She not the one. No, I mean you know I got an issue with you about that. I'm not playing with you. I'm sorry that you feel that way. Yeah, I'm sorry that you feel that way. But you should. What do you mean I'm sorry that you feel that? Why that was a bad response to what she said, but it's okay. Call me before you made the decision to put my grandson in a dress. Okay, you can speak to the No, I'm speaking to you. Please do not talk to me in that tone with my children. I wouldn't be up here if you wouldn't put my grandson in no dress. Well, do what you got to do. No, I'm taking it up with you. 
speech low or your voice. Your he got a funny you know, he got a funny accent. I'm not going to lie to you. When he say you, it's so funny. Just listen, listen. Yeah. No, I'm taking up with you. Please lower your voice. You're in a classroom. I'm taking up with you. Wait, well, you shouldn't have put my grandson in no dress. He's two. It's ain't over with. All wait, right? wait, 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 wait. She said he's two? As if that's a reason? What? He's two. Wait, wait. Your voice, you're in a classroom. I'm taking up with you. Wait, well, you shouldn't have put my grandson in no dress. He's two. It's ain't over with. All right? Nah, wait. Where the rest of the video at, bro? What happened after this? Uh, we gotta run it back. We, Cause this unanswered question. Yeah, she called me and told me that she had an issue up here about. So this is not the dad. This the grandpa. Remember, I told you I was assuming. It. I was right, basically. It's, it's the dad. Just, just be quiet. But you know what I'm saying? What's that? first of all? This classroom looks super disgusting and cluttered. But anyways, that's besides the point. My grandson being in a dress. I mean, I'm trying to see what the issue is about that. Hey, look at her. She's she look like a man. I think she's a man with a wig on, and she wanted other people to have her type of experience. You know what I'm saying? It's no problem. Do whatever the heck you want to do. I don't got no problem with nobody doing whatever the heck they want to do with their own body. Do what the heck you want to do, but don't force my kid to be over here doing that. You know what I'm saying? Like, and she said at the end that he's two, as if that's a reasoning, as if he's two, so it don't matter. Okay, you're going to have to talk to Dara. Who's Dara? Director. Down and why she keep telling me to talk to Gary? I don't want to talk to Gary. Gary ain't make me do ain't make ain't make the baby do that. Is she the is she the one that was in charge of the kids while my grandson? I, was, but I can't talk to you. Why? Why, why are you? Guys, I'm getting mad at all the same stuff that I already got mad at. Why I can't talk? Are you the one I'm supposed to be? I'm not supposed to be talking to Gary. Gary has nothing to do with this. The corn. We'll have to get Dara up here and see if she will let you. I mean, she, she will let I me mean, what? first of all, I come down here because we don't do that. The the the, uh, the transgender and all that, we, you know, we don't do that. I understand. I don't and to and I, I I don't appreciate you encouraging him to put on no dress for the second day too. I don't appreciate. And it, it's, a, it's a second day? Like this happened more than once? Why you only get out there the first time? Take that. And don't think this is going away. I'm going further with this. Okay. Go down and talk no, to I'm not done talking to you. I'm letting you know the next time that you put any kid in a dress, we're gonna make you go viral. Okay, you need to go talk to my director because it, I, as a teacher, no, I'm letting you know I got an issue with you about that. I'm not playing with you. I'm sorry that you feel that way. Yeah, I'm sorry that you feel that way. Which bad response. I'm, I'm, I'm completely pausing at all the same spots. I'm I, I'm like repetitive right now, but it's 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 just shut up. Call me before you made the decision to put my grandson in a dress. Okay, you can speak to me. No, I'm speaking to you. Please do not talk to me in that tone with my children. Around. I wouldn't be up here if you wouldn't put my grandson in no dress. Again. Well, do what you gotta do. No, I'm taking it up with you. Please lower your voice. You're in a classroom. I'm taking it up with you. Wait, well, you shouldn't have put my grandson in no dress. He's two. Why did she say that? That just made me mad. What What does him being two have to do? That means he has no... That you can do whatever the heck you want to do to him because he's two? That woman's stupid. I told y'all off rip. I didn't even know if that was the teacher, but I told y'all off rip she was a weirdo. You could tell by her fit. Literally look at her fit, bruh. It's a flannel with a, with a chain that hangs way down, all the way down to the freaking her belly button. And it's off to the side. It's a black tee, and she, I'm wearing a black tee. I'm not doing all the other craziness, though. But look at her hair, and look at her face, and look at her hands. Anyways, y'all, man, that's Envil. Let me know what y'all think in the comments down below. Y'all think it's okay that this teacher did that? Do y'all think it's okay that this teacher did that? What would y'all do if y'all, if you pick your kid up from school, your son up from school, right? He's two years old. You sent him in there with some jeans. A nice little t-shirt, nice little chain, got the Jordans on and everything like that, you know what I'm saying? And you picked him up. He had makeup on and a dress and some freaking some freaking baby high heels. What would you do? And he's two years he's two, so I don't know if that changes anything for y'all. He's two, so I don't know if that makes it okay. So it, uh, he's two. What are y'all doing? You know what I'm saying? I'm curious to know. But anyways, y'all, that's the end of the video. Smash the like button if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're not subscribed already. Hit the post notification bell if you're not hitting the post notification bell already. And I'm going to see y'all out.
Ayo, C3, so fly, hop out the butterfly Wings to the sky, no, I'm never borderline They choose I, cause I'm way above you The waves make the haters love you When the ladies come through